day to my lovely wonderful viewers welcome back to another upload so in today's upload i thought i'd do something a little bit different and that is i'm going to read through some of your comments some comments um that you wonderful viewers have left me i'm going to go through some of the good some of the bad but before i get into that i just want to discuss a few things about the comment section one being i'm, I'm gonna obviously take it from my experience and hopefully speak on the behalf of other youtubers as well who may or may not agree with me um but the comment section is obviously a place for the YouTuber to interact with the viewers, of course, the as a viewer myself, uh, to other people's channels and whatnot, it is a place where people leave their opinions, that's all it is, it isn't facts, well, I mean, it could be facts, depending on what the comment um, you've left is about, but it is mainly a place for people to come and leave their opinions, basically, um, I respect, like other YouTubers, some people choose to turn their comment section off. For me personally, if a, another YouTuber chooses to turn their comment section off, it is each to their own. If they choose to turn the comment section off, then that is entirely up to them. It's just a case of I watch the video, I go to the comment section, if it's turned off, I'm like, damn, can't leave my opinion on this video. So I'll move on to the next one. Um, I've thought about it myself because the comp the comment section does become such a complicated place basically it's it it's one of them where sometimes it's hard to judge a comment and all depending on sort of what mood personally i'm in on the day um and how i interpret it, a comment that is left so basically it's same with anything it's same with like an email or a text message how people write something because I, I make the mistake of doing this, how people some, sometimes write a comment, how the person views it or reads it might be completely different and interpret it different to the person who, you know, worded it. They might have worded it different and they might read it in a completely different way. That's why I want to do this video because I want to look through a few of the comments and see if you guys get the same feel as me because some comments you basically you can kind of judge a little bit some are nine times out of ten of my comments are very 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 supportive like my that's why i always say wonderful viewers because i nine times out of ten gets very supportive and lovely comments now and again obviously like any channel gets the occasional as we like to say troll who it doesn't matter what video you release what positive upload you release it can be about anything and everything and i'll prove this in a sec by showing you a certain comment i'm going to be highlighting these comments it doesn't matter what the video is about a troll will always drag that video down that is what they're good for and they get the kicks out of trying to bring you the creator and the video down and sometimes it's a case of you've just got to take it on the chin really sometimes i don't like to block a lot of people in all fairness i really really don't like to block anyone the reasons i block someone one mainly if they're getting very very personal and rude if they're being very very personal and very very rude i will just block them or if they are just basically being very very repetitive with their comments every time i do a video i i will point out what, a couple of people who i have blocked who will probably come across in the comment section as i'm showing you this someone let's say caroline ball because not only do the people like this comment on my uploads you'll find them in other people's comment section saying the exact same thing they've got nothing new to bring to the table basically and they say the same thing so basically regarding a few of my uploads recently when i've been going to shopping centers and recording in there every single comment is saying it's private property when are you people gonna learn you're not allowed to record on private property it's the same every time and there's just there's nothing more you can say to them it just bec they become very boring 
I just get rid. You know what I mean? But yeah, other, other than that, if people just come on my comment section and say this bit video were boring, I didn't like it, didn't enjoy this video, then fine. That's your opinion. If that's what you think, I'm sure other people agree with you. I'm sure other people disagree with you. But if you think my video is boring, I'm not just going to block you for saying something like that. However, I do also want to point out another thing um, with the comment section. What Obviously, we get a lot of complaints on what people aren't aware of, which I'm going to highlight as well. Now, when it comes to the comments, and again, I will prove this as well, and I can do a bit of an experiment with you guys. If you want to join in here, I welcome everybody to come and comment on this video, leave whatever message they want, whether it be nasty or swearing it as much as you want. But what we get as uploaders is, oh, look at you, you don't like free speech because you've gone and deleted my comment. And then they cry, cry, cry. And no, I we don't nine times out of ten delete comments. YouTube do. And there's a couple of things what YouTube do. Sometimes they leave a completely delete. If you if uh, if someone is leaving a comment and they're just simply being foul mouthed swearing in the comments whatever youtube's reasons is for it they'll just simply delete it without even us being aware that i i haven't seen the comment it's just been simply deleted other occasions comments can be put on hold for review and this is where um the rev comment will only only i can see it and then i can either approve or disapprove of it and usually there is um a sort of thing to that where if and some people aren't aware of this and i'll point this out again if you leave a comment but you attach a link to that comment um usually people do do this like they will be pointing another channel out to me or they were pointing another video out to me so they'll you share that youtuber's page and they'll put the link in with their comment that will instantly get put on held for review because you're not allowed to share links well i've um gone for that option you're not allowed to share um links in the comment section purely because a lot of the links some people lead lead links lead into as you're aware on un... no, not nice sites basically sometimes they're harmless and it is just to another channel my um advice for that would be if you are recommending someone to me don't put it as a link just put the name of the person and the name of the video and i will check that out and go and uh check their channel out and leave that as a comment that way rather than the link because the link will not show up and the other way links don't um comments don't show up and like i said go ahead let's experiment with this you guys can go and do this to your heart content and pe like i said people mainly the trolls they're so foul mouthed they can't leave a comment without basically being damn right rude obnoxious and basically being offensive and swerving them swerving in the comments so go and leave a comment swear if you would like try not be too maybe offensive put a few swear words in there and you'll notice the comment section will it won't appear in the comment section however on my part sometimes the comment I, it, I'll get a notification saying that comment has been left. I'll click on the comment, but then it says this comment is no longer available. It's either been deleted or been removed, but I can still see the comment. And in the past, I've taken a screenshot of that and I've shared it. So if you don't believe me, I will prove that after this video. If you want to leave a comment by swearing and I see it, I'm not going to do it if I get loads of them. I'm not going to share every single one, but I'll do it a few times where if you leave a comment, you swear, I'll take a screenshot of it and then I'll share it to my community page just to show you that I do not delete comments. Any swearing in it, any rude, disrespectful comments will instantly get deleted by YouTube. Um, so, yeah, another point, thing I want to point out, which I've only become aware of recently by BuzzText, is how, obviously, I was unaware of this. I don't understand how this works, if it's true or not, whatever, because now it, the video is no longer there, so I don't know if he's removed it or for whatever reason, but obviously it showed a case of where comments can be adjusted. You can go to someone's comment, adjust it, take a screenshot. So, basically, what I'm saying is, 
don't believe everything you read in the comment section and also don't take everything personal in the comment section like i say for me personally nine times out of ten i get absolutely 100 percent lovely lovely supportive comments and that's why i i'm grateful and appreciate all comments i get even if they're not so good but sometimes, like I say, I get not so nice comments. And again, depending what mood I'm in, sometimes, and again, we'll come across a few of these, hopefully, and let's see if you agree with me. I, I'll get a troll who'll leave a comment, but I like to have a bit of back and forth. Like, there's a little bit of banter in there. And I like to, as I say, I like to have a bit of cat and mouse with them. Um, and as I said, the cat always wins. No, I don't always, but I just like to have a bit of back and forth. And it's a bit of banter like in the comments section. Because comments, like I say, can be so hard to read. Anyway, without any further ado, I know I've rambled on a bit here. A lot of you's probably already tuned off now because I bore a lot of people to death. But let's get into the comments and let's have a look through some and I'll read them out. Let's see if you agree with me. And like I say either go and reply to because that's another thing as well sometimes I, I really really enjoy seeing is when a troll leaves a, a, a horrible comment sometimes I don't need to reply to that because as I say my wonderful viewers will read that and they'll respond to that comment for me I'll show you a quick example of that right now let's have a look so like I say let's click on my recent upload that I did which was this one um I don't need to play the video, so I'll go and pause it there. You can go and check that out yourself. But this was basically a upbeat, laid-back, positive video. And as you can see, got a few comments here. Let's have a look through my comments. Batman, my wonderful, long-time supporter. Um, lovely, lovely comment. He always leaves me really really nice feedback he's always so supportive batman freedom to me is the ability to be yourself in your trustest form truest form sorry i'm i'm a bit that see this is what i mean about reading comments sometimes I, I do struggle it's being able to make your own choices and control the agency of your own life and while i know i've been privileged enough to have my own freedoms in life i know that's not normal for many all over the world a part of celebrating my own freedom means doing what i can to help others find their own freedom lovely video catwoman as always a very lovely amazing supportive comment as we scroll down brilliant video thank you for sharing positive jake the big up jake the trousers snake you know what I mean? Another lovely comment from him. He's quite supportive. UK immigration law. Um, go check out this guy's uh, channel too. He always has nice, lovely things to say. Trevor, again, another long-standing, lovely, lovely supporter. Um, always has lovely things to say. Of course, the one and only Pinaki News, the one who um, shared my channel just over a year ago. Again, very supportive to my channel. Big up Pinaki News. Um, someone here who's telling me that they're recovering from a chest infection and they've not been able to get out recently. So, Mark, I really hope you do get better. Um, I really do. Go and show Mark a lot of love then. Hope, wish him a fast recovery. Um, but anyway, yeah, so there's, you can go check them come out yourself. If we scroll down here, of course, I get one comment here. Like I say, you remind me of Nora Batty. I've got no idea who that is, but nevertheless, being disrespectful to any firefighters, you know, the people who would go into your house if it was on fire to help save your life. Now, this is quite clearly a troll. A comment, it's, I see that as a negative comment. I did share this on my community post the other day. I see this comment as a negative one. Um, and obviously, comment commenting something that has absolutely nothing to do with this video so let's go and have a look at the replies here so obviously you know there's no other word for them but troll i don't want to call them a troll but what else can you call them um 
So only a troll could turn a positive upload like this into a negative and chat rubbish about something that has no relevance to the upload, which she doesn't. I know exactly what upload she's going on about and we may go flip back to that video in a minute, but there we go, someone said there, please explain as this is clearly nothing to do. And this is what I mean about some people coming in and supporting me. So I recently saw her video harassing firefighters, um... And, and like I said, I've replied to that, um, saying, well, why, basically, why didn't she go and leave that this comment on that video instead of this one? Why did she have to leave it on this one? But then uh, this is this is the supportiveness that I'm talking about. Terry here, who, again, is usually very, very lovely in the comment section. I always have something nice to say. She's come here, jumped to my defence and said, I watched that video. So she, clearly she knows what video this person's on about as well i watched that video and showed my husband who is a firefighter and um and he said what well, cat was in no way disrespectful which i can say clearly right now i wasn't so obviously this is just somebody who is is basically just being a troll and trying to drag this my, me and my channel down and then obviously we've got somebody else here jumping on the van wagon too and agreeing with this person as well with again carrying it on and being negative so I've replied you know what I mean and a, a lot of these negative trolls they really don't know what they're talking about nine times out of ten they really don't they're just basically assuming watching one video one upload and making assumptions and basically judging which they're entitled to do like i said the comments the comments is there for people to leave their opinions so basically let's go back anyway and check out some of my older oops some of my older uploads and as you can see i have done quite a few now over the past year so i'm going to flip back to some of my old videos and we're going to have a read back through some of the comments on them um i know which video i would like to talk about what my i'm going to talk about my first major major audit that i ever did where i, I came close to being put in cuffs so let's flip this one right here. So go check this I one out. Let's give that a pause there. 557 comments. So there we go. Let's have a look at these comments here. So let's have a look at the... Do you know what? I love pinning comments. And sometimes I kind of wish I could pin more than one because I get so many su supportive comments. I kind of wish... Oh, Sorry about that, knocking my phone over. <laughs> I kind of wish uh, I could um, pin more than one comment. But let's have a look at this one. There we go. Uh, what a brave stand over these thuggish goons. Really unpleasant people. Heaven help anyone who falls into their clutches. How dare they shove Ozzy around? Got to say, you handled the situation like a seasoned trooper. And by the way, I left a link to your video on the station's google review site hope you don't mind so that is absolutely awesome not only has she left a comment on my video they've taken it one step further by going and leaving a comment on the google review site which is what we want basically what we these people need to know when they are going wrong um you know and they shouldn't be treating the public this way so let's have a flick through and see if i can find some other comments here Oh, Bannerman, the one and awesome Bannerman, who always has awesome, awesome, very informative feedback to leave. It, Bannerman knows exactly what he is talking about when he comes to leaving comments. Sad but bad, mad lad is another one who always leaves very supportive, informative comments. And this is also a good idea as well, a bit of good advice. If you're talking about a specific part of the upload, try timestamp it. So the, if we click on that timestamp, it will take you directly to that bit that this comment is referring to, which is always a good idea. But yeah, sad but mad lad again another wonderful viewer like i say you you handled the, those scruffy unprofessional tyrants well see now this is the thing i you know in the same way would i like to be called scruffy should these people be called scruffy now again a comment like this obviously they're defending me however 
is that needed? It's kind of a little bit, you know, it's only, let's face it, it's only a harmless word. It's nothing too offensive there. But, you know, it's kind of calling these people scruffy, which I would have personally said they were. I would just call them, obviously, very, very unprofessional. So, but that's obviously his opinion. Uh, well done. The female officer is totally out of her depth. She's clueless. Again, positive. Um, again, Panaki News. Um, Stupin Fal Falcon. He's always a very another um, quite good supporter. He's always has something nice feedback. Um, I'm trying to flick through here and try and find a little bit of a negative comment if I can, really. Um, if it's a bit more non your business, again, always been very supportive of me. Big up non your business. Um, excuse me, guys. I am, like I say, again, another timestamp there, which is always a good idea. Once again, Batman. Uh, you should have said so. This is this is your your dog's freezing cold. You should have said so. Is your cat at least mine as a coat on? <laughs> I don't see that's a little bit. Is your dog's freezing cold? You should have said so. Is your cat? Oh, right, yeah, yeah, I get where he's coming from now. See, I'm this is a bit a long time ago, so I'm sort of miss going back over this again. At least mine as a coat on, yeah. So, obviously, on that day, I did this order, I bought Ozzy a coat. So uh, let's keep flying through here. Let's see. I'm trying to find what a constructive way to spend your time. Well done. You're really making the world a better place. Again, like I say, what a constructive way to spend your time. Well done. You're really making the world a better place. Mm, is that a positive comment or a negative one? I'm not quite sure there because we do get, have you got nothing else better to do? Commented a lot which is kind of similar to what a constructive way to spend your time. Now, obviously, quite clearly, this is my hobby. This is what I enjoy doing. So, yeah, to me, this is a constructive way to spend my time because like me and many other people, I enjoy going out and about and filming. That is my hobby and that is what I enjoy doing. So, again, is this a negative comment or is it a positive one? not quite sure about that one. So, there we go. That's what I mean. How would you, how would you read that comment? Uh, there we go. Let's keep flicking. Bunch of absolute brilliant cats. See, most of these are quite positive. This is what I'm talking about. I usually get maybe one or two negative comments on each upload. I do. Um, Diane PGR. I'm sorry. I, she's always been very, very supportive and always leaves lovely feedback as well. Um, Catwoman certainly earned her stripes on this one, though that's a positive. Um, oh my god, I'm right. Let me flick forward, I'll probably flick forward a bit to this to see if I can come across a, a rude one. <laughs> of course, we've got uh, Matt 12128 again, buddy of mine, always as you know, when he does leave comments, of, again, very supportive of me as I am to him. Let's leave this one here. Uh, what do you expect the police to do? Just let you and all other smack rats to just wander around police stations taking photos and film and not question it. Hmm. Is that constructive feedback or is that negative? I mean, obviously calling us smack rats, that's a little bit disrespectful. Again, it's just a harmless name. Not offended by it at all, but obviously brings the comment down a little bit i'd see that as a bit constructive feedback because yeah he is right in what he's saying you know do should should off, um, police officers just ignore us or should they come out and question us but it's how they conduct themselves as well as how we can conduct ourselves too read this one i'm the first one to hold police officers to account but when you have some someone doing this who clearly doesn't understand the law has issues stringing a coherent sentence together and wants to antagonize the police officers stop them doing their jobs it doesn't have the same calibre 
I'm an ex-medic and the amount of times people would say I pay your wages and guarantee your name was never on my wage slip. I also paid my own wages. Personally, this video would have been more interesting if someone had arrested you for being a tool. I feel sorry for police having to deal with a small gene pool when dealing with you. So, this is obviously, she. this is a comment who someone who doesn't agree with what I've done here but let's just break this down a little bit so first she's saying someone who can't string a, a sentence together well I could agree with that on some levels because I've got to admit I'm not the best at articulating myself so she's sort of right there I will agree with her on a little bit of that but sometimes it's struggle to get the what I'm trying to explain out but me antagonising police, that's something I definitely don't do. Obviously, again, we get a lot of that off people. Oh, you're just going around sticky camera in people's faces and antagonising the police, which, of course, if you lot, you supportive lot who know my channel well, know that is not something I don't do. But let's have a look at my replies here. Let's see what I put here because I can't actually remember. What are we, that? Uh, let's see, I can't even read my own comment. <clears throat> what? With that ridiculous comment, my ass, you would hold any cop accountable. And no wonder you are an ex-medic. What did you mess up? You have, She obviously messed up somewhere by saying she's a med... So I'm just basically asking her there, um, why is she an ex-medic? What, you know, she, uh, did she leave? Did she get fired? But, you know, again, I'm not being rude. I'm not calling her names there. But obviously she's responded. Um, nope, no mess up. Just came into very large windfall after using my noggins okay fair enough investing so no longer have to work so she chose to quit a job because she came into a bit of cash fair dues probably similar to you without the dosh bit <laughs> also i have held the police accountable with my phone written complaints well if you can agree with what these officers did and how you you thought these com officers conducted yourselves and agree with this well then that just goes to show that where your morals lie oh i'm pleased to learn to string a sentence together well i'm sorry but i'm i'm not I'm sorry for not being the best speaker in the world. I obviously can't string a sentence together, but on the other hand, I'm not the best speaker in the world. Again, I again, I'm, everyone entitled to their own opinions, I guess. You, my keyboard warrior friend, are one of 3,000 people who doesn't like this, so no skin off my nose. Thanks for the views and comments. Every, anyway, that's something I always put in response sometimes i always put because i again no matter whether you're a troll or not i always appreciate the feedback and the views anyway so yeah that's the, you know it's a 50 50 game here we get 50 percent supportive people and nice comments and other ones we don't so um let's keep going oh big up marty black bruh. big up you absolutely smashed this one uh, let's keep going. Oh, the one and only live free now, I think. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this was probably the very first um, video that live free actually commented on. Whether I don't know if he was watching any of the other uploads, but this is, was one of the very first ones he watched and they're probably the only one he has ever commented on. So, you know what I mean? He obviously appreciated this upload but this was probably the first and last time i ever heard from him in my comment section but i appreciate it nonetheless chris colin again another supportive person um let's flick onto another video here and see if i can find another video uh let's see if i can find another video find some other comments have a look at this one shall okay. we pause this uh really love the building and the water features also great that people are friendly great video um i spy order again go check that guy's channel out two brothers that on eg are buying asda again sometimes people leave very informative comments things that i'm not even aware of myself so you learn sometimes you learn things from the comment section again trevor Kat, can you explain to me where you get a free coffee at home as I have to buy the coffee, milk and sugar to go into it? Keep up the good work. <laughs> uh, again, sad but mad lad. 
uh, build, this building must have cost the taxpayer a fortune. There's always a lot of w wasted money. Again, Batman. Uh, where, where is your mask? Boring. <laughs> oh, is that it? No more on there. Let's have a look, keep flicking. Let's have a look at this one. Let's make this the last one. Oh, Sasha Blue's always another supportive comment. It leaves other, you know, really nice comments on my channel throughout my the year. Uh, great. I'm, tr I'm honestly, I'm struggling here trying to find some negative comments or some uh, some different comments. You're the rude one here. He was polite. Again, maybe if you could sort of um, sp uh, um, specific, um, specifically, is that the right word? Specifically, um, say how I was rude. In, if you go back through any of my videos, do I swear? Do I call them names? I think you'll find that I nine times out of ten, I really, really don't. I am very gobby. I have admitted that, but... I really, really try not to be rude. So I love it when people say you're the rude one. How and in what way am I being rude or obnoxious or, you know, anything else that these people accuse us of being? What's the point in this? Mm, well, that's for you to figure out. I can't really explain that. Again, a lot of people who don't understand these videos, well, that's... <laughs> How can I explain it? I mean, I can bit. I can, I've got a million and ways I could explain it, but probably none of them that you will accept. So I, you know what I mean. Let's have a look at the responses to this. There, obviously, there we go. It's just wasting the police officer's time, is it? Also, did I ask you pipe down, little one? See, look how many times it's spammed in the comment section as well. Oh, oh, well and good. No, no skin off my nose by him doing this. Uh, oh, it looks like someone's responded to him, but gone back and deleted the comments because it's all is. So it may be responding to somebody else's comments who've deleted him or whose channel no longer exists. It's the fact that it is that that it can also be defined as it's advised the laws. I don't understand that at all. Not illegal, but is it not illegal? But it isn't the right thing to go wasting police time. Again, another pretty much similar comment that we get across the board: wasting police time. Are we really wasting police time? Uh, we're not asking these officers to come out. They can go about their business, getting on with what they need to do, and leave us alone doing what we keep knocking my phone over excuse me um and yeah basically leave us to get on so i for one i'm not wasting police time i know a lot of people obviously will disagree with that absolutely awful audit again that's a bit of a basic comment i mean they've not really put why see here, here we go i've even asked you mind actually saying why and of course they haven't responded because you know that's obviously again like I said that's their opinion absolutely awful audit well fair enough if that's the way you think but maybe go into a little bit more detail why did you find it so awful what was awful about it you know what I mean um and clearly she hasn't responded to that so this is what I'm saying about it's just that's her opinion you know some people will agree with it other people won't so as you saw there I flick through quite a few comments there um and obviously as you can see a majority of them are very supportive very supportive indeed i don't get a lot of negative comments which i'm so happy about but as i say let's all you know jump on it is for the trolls to jump on board let's have a little experiment here oh jump on leave any opinion you want down in the comment section below tell me how ugly i am tell me how boring i am because quite honestly it really doesn't bother me as i say it is all a matter of your opinion not a fact you know some people will agree with you some people won't like i said i will not delete any comments 
if you are swearing mind youtube will delete them so the comments may or may not show as i say whether again you agree with me or not but i will do this again I, i've got plenty of other videos and i will go through this um again and again we'll break down some more comments because like i said there is some certain comments that i really do want to go discuss including one particular person as any of you long-standing supporters will know about my favorite troll who i haven't really seen for a while bobby brown who he came onto my channel and i will show that video in the um yeah the video in the next upload and talk about when he first started commenting and like i say it was good to, and it was fun to have a bit of banter with him again i haven't seen him for a while i don't know where he's disappeared to he sort of pops up every now and again then he disappears for ages so whether he's still around i don't know but some come i overall i genuinely genuinely enjoy reading the comments sometimes i can't get through all the comments that is impossible to do as you can see I am a smaller channel, so I really don't get a lot of comments. Um, let's say for somebody who gets, you know, a big, a massive, massive channel, someone like Charlie Beach or AB, who probably gets comments in the thousands. You know what I mean? I personally, I spend, usually when I upload a video, um, I'll respond to the comments within that first day or so. After that, I tend really not to go back over the comments unless obviously I'm doing something like this. But when I upload a video like now, if I upload this, I'll go through the comments, whatever comments I get till usually about the end of today. And then I probably won't look again because otherwise you could spend forever and ever and ever going through comments, which it can become quite draining. Again, another reason why possibly some people do choose to turn the comment section off. And obviously for, like I said, bigger YouTubers who get comments in the thousands, it's probably impossible to go through every single comment. As you can see, I only really get a few. Um, sometimes on different videos, some I get less, some I get more. Um, sometimes I get the odd comment popping up on my odd older videos, which I don't tend to really look at. Um, I only look at comments on my newer uploads. So again, if you want to leave any comment on this, uh, you know, on this upload, go ahead. It can be anything you want. Like I say, if you choose to swear, then you choose to swear. I, I really don't mind. But like I say, probably YouTube will go ahead and delete it. So if it doesn't show up, you'll know why. But if I see it, I possibly may or may not uh, take a screenshot of it and I'll share it on my community post just to prove it to you. Um, but yeah, so like I said, give me your feedback. How do you interpret comments when you read them? Can you tell when you're reading a negative to a positive one or someone having a bit of a laugh? Because there is a difference. There is, a, in my opinion, there is a very big difference between freedom of speech and hate speech. You know what I mean? Like I say, someone coming onto my comment section and saying, this video is very, very boring. You are very ugly. That's just freedom of speech. You know what I mean? No, that's just, it's not a fact. It's just someone's pointing out their personal opinion. I've not got an issue with that. However, someone coming along and swerving and being abusive and basically what sometimes what a lot of trolls, and I have experienced this a couple of times, what a, troll, a lot of trolls do do, if they realise they're not getting to me or putting me down, they'll turn to something else, which is usually obviously family or Aussie, something they know that might mean something to you, so they'll turn their attention to them and try and bring you down by calling them out instead, hoping that hurts you. But nevertheless, like I say, it is just all opinions. Um, like I say, I don't delete comments, uh, whether they're constructive, negative or whatever. If you are basically constantly, as I said, rude on a regular basis and you're just not bringing anything nice to my channel, I, after a while, again, depending on, all depending what mood I'm in, I will get shut. A lot of people say, just ignore these people, just ignore them. Um, the, all they want is attention, which I totally agree. However, sometimes it is, like I said, it is just, it's just, it, I don't know these people. I, these people mean, you know, I, I don't know them, I don't know them from Adam, it's just a name in the comment section, leaving their opinion, so it, may, it makes no odds to me when they leave a comment, a nasty comment, whether I delete them or not, 
it make, really doesn't make any odds to me. Sometimes I'll delete them, sometimes I, I just scroll past, other times I'll respond to them. Like I say, sometimes other people will respond to them on my behalf, which is always fun to see. I I enjoy seeing a bit of tick for tat between viewers, which is always good. But nine times out of ten, like I say, trolls, you'll usually find them in other people's uploads doing the same on their channel. So I'm not privileged in any way, shape or form with that. Like I said, they're the same throughout other videos too. A troll is a troll at the end of the day. But as I say, nine times out of ten, you guys are 100% wonderful and supportive. Like I say, guys, please like, share. And as always, go ahead, leave all your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. I will check them out. Some, I will screenshot them and share to my community page. And we'll see what people people's opinions are on the comment section. Do you like it when people turn the comment section off? Do you not? Personally, like I say, makes no difference to me. I support a person irregardless to who they are, whether they have the comment section on or not. If I like a video, I'll support it. Sometimes I'll leave a comment, sometimes I don't. Same with if I don't enjoy what I'm watching. If I don't enjoy what I'm watching, I usually... So nine times out of ten, if I don't enjoy what I'm watching, I don't leave a comment. I just cross it off, move on to the next video. Simple as that. But anyway, rambled on, as always. Waffled on. I'm a gobby Lancashire lass, as I always say. Go and tell me down in the comment section below, like I say, how I can't string a sentence together, as that person in the comment section clearly said. I somewhat do agree with it go ahead and mock me down in the comment section see you in the next upload